How you doing? I'm Jim Myrick with the Myrick and Young team. In today's topic, we're going to talk about stats and numbers that are specific to Santa Clara Valley. We're experiencing a little bit of a shortage in inventory and, and there's a lot of demand for properties right now, which is a mystery to most of the people in, in different parts of the country. I talk to a lot of associates in, in the Midwest and some people on the East Coast and they're going like, I can't believe you're experiencing such an incredible market. Well, let's go through the numbers and maybe talk about you can kind of see where, where that, that is going. So as far as close of escrow properties, last month we closed about 437 units in townhouses and condominiums. Now the um, last year at the same time we did 406. So we had a little bit of an increase there. It was, wasn't a whole heck of a lot, but it, it was a good increase. Now the single family housing, actually the closed amount went down a little bit from 996 units last year this time in, in, in March of 2011, it was 996. And this year, at the same time that month is 968. Now here's the interesting numbers that are happening, okay? Is that the amount of properties that were just sold and put into escrow last month Okay, last year this time for condominiums and townhouses, we were at 447 units. And now, this last month, we did 538 units. That was an increase of 18% more units done in a single month just for the townhouses and condominiums. Now, even, even better on our single family units is that we did last year this time 1,071 units in uh, March of 2011 and this year in 2012 we did 1,422 which is about a 24 percent increase. That's incredible. Um, also in, in the, the what's, what's the makeup? What's, the, what's going on with the REOs or the, the foreclosures and the short sales going on? In the condominiums 50 percent of the properties that were just sold were made up of foreclosures and short sales. Okay, now that's that's come down quite a bit from the from the mid 60s in the condominiums and in, 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 uh, in townhomes. Now in uh, single family homes, that's that is actually only 35 percent of the sales are done through the REOs and the short sales or the foreclosures. Now this time last year, our interest rate was about 4.875 percent. Today it's it's about a little about about four percent. Now our final number, uh, what, we, what you want to really think about what's going on when you're going out there trying to find a home. Our current inventory, standing inventory, that's available for you to make an offer on is about 1,218 single family units and it's about 311 townhouses and condos for a whopping total of about 1,529 units. Okay, so I want to put this in comparison. San Jose, which is in, right in the Santa Clara Valley, is the 10th largest city in the nation. We have a little less than about a million people. With our inventory, as we said, 1,529 units currently available. Dallas, Texas is number nine as far as the largest cities in the United States. And they have about 1.2 million people in there, a couple hundred thousand more than we do. And their inventory is about 22,000. So I want you to think about that. 1,529 compared to 22,000. We have a very, very different market. And we need to know what the local stats are in our area so we're able to make decisions in our area with a little bit more information other than the national news. I know the national news keeps on blowing that up and blowing out what's going on with, with uh, um, the national market like it's really we are having the same effects here and it's just not true. Okay, we are, we are a very different economy. Our economy is connected to a lot of the other countries and other areas outside of our area when some of the other areas inside of the, our nation they're, they're very I don't want to say is, is uh, um, segregated from the rest of the world. They have things that they kind of feed upon themselves that their, their particular, uh, their exports aren't as, as, as big as ours here as far as uh, intellectual um, uh, properties and, and a lot of our products. So anyway, I hope those figures help you out. Uh, stay tuned and we're going to start doing this on a, on a regular basis in regards to some interesting stats that you might want to be aware of when you're making your home purchase. So again, thanks for uh, coming on to our blog, 
And uh, if you have any questions, please contact us at the below number. Thank <laughs> you.